In this video, we will demonstrate how to replace the M.2 2230 Solid State Drive, or SSD. Before removing the M.2 2230 Solid State Drive, read through the safety guidelines to protect your computer from potential damage and ensure your personal safety. For more information about safety guidelines, see the Inspron 7300-7400 service manual at dell.com support. Ensure that you create a recovery drive and back up all data before removing the M.2 2230 solid state drive. Before you begin, ensure that you turn off your computer and disconnect all attached peripherals. Before removing the base cover, remove any microSD card installed in the microSD card slot on your computer. To remove the base cover, loosen the three captive screws that secure the base cover to the palm rest and keyboard assembly. Remove the four screws that secure the base cover to the palm rest and keyboard assembly. Using a plastic scribe, pry the base cover from the top of the left side and then continue to work on the sides to open the base cover. Lift the base cover off the palm rest and keyboard assembly. Disconnect the battery cable from the connector on the system board. Turn the computer over and open the display. Press and hold the power button for 15 seconds to ground the computer and drain the flea power. After draining the flea power, close the display and turn the computer over. Now, let's remove the M.2 2230 solid state drive. Lift the mylar that covers the system board and peel the thermal tape that covers the SSD and bracket. Remove the screw that secures the M.2 2230 bracket to the system board. Slide and lift the bracket off of the system board. Slide and lift the SSD from the M.2 card slot on the system board. You have now successfully removed the SSD. Now, Let's see how to install the M.2 2230 solid state drive. Align the notches on the SSD with the tabs on the M.2 card slot on the system board. Slide the SSD into the M.2 card slot on the system board. Align the notch on the M.2 2230 bracket to the groove on the SSD and slide the bracket onto the system board. Replace the screw that secures the bracket to the system board. Adhere the thermal tape that covers the SSD. You have successfully installed the M.2 2230 solid state drive. Now, connect the battery cable to the connector on the system board. Reinstall the base cover by aligning it with the palm rest and keyboard assembly and pressing the edges and sides until it snaps into place. Now, tighten the three captive screws and replace the four screws to secure the base cover to the computer. The solid state drive installation process is now complete. For more information, please see the Dell and Spron 7300-7400 instruction manual at dell.com support.